Ethan, you struck out the side in the first inning on 13 pitches. Did you know right away this was going to be a good night? Well, in the pen, I kind of felt a little fatigued, so I, I didn't think it was going to be a bad night. I was definitely going to go out there and give my all, but I think first inning, I felt really good. I mean, fastball felt good. Everything felt good except the slider. So, yeah, I thought it was going to be good. Uh, what did it feel like pitching in this type of environment in this ballpark? Yeah, I mean, it's a beautiful ballpark. Uh, you can't get better than the state championship out there. It felt amazing. To hold them to just one run, what does that say about your effort and also Bryce coming in to close? I mean, they're, they're a solid team over there. They, they hit the ball, they hunt fastballs, and, and Ricker. I mean, so we had a game plan going in, and we executed it. And we now that it's over, give me some details on the game plan. So we saw the Kessinger kid. We were trying to start off speed and then go up with the fastball. But I saw his bat pass. It was like uppercut. So I felt like if, it, if I got a high fastball and caught up to it, it was going to go. So I just tried to keep it low so, and it tossed it up. So that was pretty much all. <laughs> How about Bryce Wunderlich in the yeah. number nine hole coming up with that go-ahead RBI single? I mean, yeah, he's been big in the nine hole the whole year, so I mean, that was, that was a huge hit and got us all on top. You guys were runner-up in the county, runner-up in the district. Uh, how does it feel to get over the top and get that gold? Yeah, I mean, we were definitely tense in the county and district. So I felt like Coach loosened us up and said, like, let's go make history because Mifflin's never won a state game and Governor Mifflin's never won a state title. So I felt like we were just loose and played our game. Uh, your catcher Jenkins knocked in the first run for the team, and he, he's so valuable behind the plate. What does he mean to this club? I mean, he's a dog. Uh, he, he gives it all every game. And, yeah, he, he just, he's so good. Uh, was this your best outing considering what was on the line? I mean, you've had a lot of good ones. Yeah, I mean, I don't think it was my best outing because I, I felt fatigued. But I definitely think it's up there because state championship and you so. And 11 strikeouts yeah. and only two hits. That's yeah. not too shabby. Not too bad. <laughs> what do you want to work on going into your senior year? Uh, definitely getting stronger. I feel like if I get stronger, everything will progress. So I feel like getting stronger than working on my off-speed and everything will be fine. Uh, favorite post game meal after uh, a championship win? Oh, uh, we always go to Dairy Queen after the game, so I think Dairy Queen. Are you a Blizzard guy? No, no, no. I just get chicken fingers. You don't get ice cream? No, I don't get ice cream. Who goes why. to Dairy Queen and doesn't get ice cream? It hurts my stomach. I don't know why. <laughs> Not even like a regular cone, a chocolate or vanilla? I sometimes get a twist, but that's it. I just get chicken fingers. Interesting. Yeah. Learn something new every day. Yeah. Well, go enjoy it. Thank you.